Now then, ladies, I've made it out. Got the old rucksack on again, and I'm doing the Jubilee Way. Beaver, Wolfsport? No, Wolfsport by Beaver. Mount from Mowbray, and if I've got the legs left, up to Butter on the hill. So, we set off. My mate dropped me off earlier. I don't know, be about seven o'clock I started this. We've come through the cow fields and we're down the other side of Wallsthorpe, heading up to Beaver. So hopefully get some nice pictures of the castle. We've got some woolly friends. We're nearly there. I don't think we're going to get many views of the castle though. Dog can't get to the sheep, she's not happy. She wants to wind them up. Does that look like a, a giant mushroom to anyone else? Funny looking tree. So where has this come from? The mist. And that's where we're going. I think we're in Plunger Woods now. I've been pressing on. We're averaging 5.6k an hour. So we're doing alright. I don't know how far I've travelled. Probably 7k, seven, seven, something like that. In about an hour and a half, two hours, I can't remember. Left about seven. But nice, bit of lovely woodland. We can't see the views. We're running along the ridge of the Vale of Beaver, but there's just pea soup out there. Well, I'm going to have a cup of tea before I leave the woods. Oh, that's that old monument. Soupy. Bit of wild camping going on. Bit of Stella Artois. Sit down. Sit. Get a drink. Get a drink, is then. There's the wild campers. You can see that tent from the top of the hill. It's halfway up the hill, you can see it from miles away. Hang on. I had a Lancaster bomber crashed here. I didn't know that. 1942. Oh, that's nice. Whew. It's about midday. I've been going for five hours or so. I reckon I've done. I'm nearly at Mountain, and I reckon I reckon Mountain was going to be about 15, 16 miles, and about five from Mountain up to Boa, I think. Well, I'm less than a mile from Mountain. I've got to be. Okay, a nice little bridge to go over. Feet dry. Well, dry it. I've been hitting my trainers today, so I've had wet feet. I've had to change my socks a few times, but we're all right now. Now the sun's come out and got rid of you. So, yeah, I had a quick cup of tea in Scrawford and a sandwich. I didn't start for very long. I've just seemed to be on one, on a mission to get there. So, 
Yeah, it won't be long before we're in Country Park. Now I'm coming into the Country Park from the same way as last time, but not from down the railway. So I was just down the railway last time. And I've been coming through sheep fields. Ah, grass fields, presumably sheep. Quite regular, here's another one. Cup of tea time. And I've got a couple of slices of bread and some peanut butter, milk, tea bag. Got it on the petrol stove today. Staring my feet out, changing my socks again. Dogs catching five minutes. Uh, just on the outskirts of Burton Lazarus, we've done Melton. And we're pressing on. We're going to do the full 21 miles. Sun's come out. Be out. Let's make a brew. Oh, we've done quite a bit of road work <coughs> from Little Dolby around to Boa. I should have jumped on the Leicestershire round, but I wanted to do the uh, the full Jubilee. So we've probably just done half a mile, a mile on the road. But there's the hill. A boa on the hill. It's a bit sunny. But that's ideal. So you could say one of the names straight. Probably got a couple of K to do. And then I've done the full... Well, that's a bit gash in the countryside, isn't it? I'm still on a steep hill. That's going down. And it broke us off. That goes all the way to Burton Lazarus where they're putting a new pipeline in. You can see it right up. Look at the top in the middle there. Well, if it snows, it'd make a good toboggan. 21 miles I've done it. The Jubilee Way. From Wolves Fort by Beaver to Boa on the Hill. And I've not even been near Boa on the Hill, it's over there. But this, I'm turning up at the main car park for Boa on the Hill, and that is the end of the Jubilee Way according to the Ordnance Survey map. Oh, I've just got to get home now. No one's answering the phone. Or if they are, they don't want to come. So it's either going to be another three hours walk home or see if I can scrounge a lift. Let's go and have a look at the hill there. Looks a bit more hilly. I've just come up that holla there, the entrance to the fort. What a place to feed the cows on top of the hill. We're still mossing on, got no lift yet. Made my cup of tea and I took it with me, got the lid on it. To be fair, it's easier to carry it. Like that. You don't spill any, you just wobble along. Well, hopefully I've got a lift sorted, but it's still going to be half hour probably. So, we're making the way back. I've only got one more brow to see and I'll be able to see Melton. One more brow to summit. I can see the brow from back there, but as I'm getting closer to it. I'm still going down and then I've got to go up. But what a day I've been blessed with. We had a bit dewy this morning. And then the sun's come up about 11, burnt the dew off. Got rid of the fog. And yeah, it gave us a lovely day. The sun is absolutely blaring. It has been gorgeous. Not too warm, not too hot. 
I've had to take my jumper and bits off, but yeah, I've not been sweating, so we've been all right. Um, I've slowed down a little bit, I won't lie, my legs are steak aching pretty well. When you stop and then get going again, that first few hundred metres takes a bit of get a going, but we're all right. We're carrying on. Right, I'll get my cup of tea down me. And see how far I get before my lift turns up. I'm muffing and puffing well. That's Boa on the L. And I came in. Where did I come in? Boom. Down that edge there. Oh. I come off this top here and down and through and across. My finger's getting in the way. There is a brown field with a grass triangle in the corner. That's where I have my drone, that brown triangle in the corner in the middle of the screen. That's where I was flying my drone and the tree in the middle right at the top, that's where I was walking around Boa. Mental! Absolutely mental!